So, this is what a movie theater should sound like. But instead, we have loud conversations spoiling the movie, blinding phone screens that interrupt the ambiance, sticky, messy seats. Have you ever been the victim of these heinous acts? If so, you may have had a bad experience with the movie theater, like myself. So, movie theater etiquette. Did you know that movie theaters have opened up to the idea of letting people have their cell phones during movies? This comes straight from a variety interview with the CEO of AMC, Adam Aaron. This, of course, got met with a wave of hostility by every sane person using social media. Uh, also, Diane Gottman, an etiquette, an expert etiquette blogger, said that if you get your refreshment before you go sit down for a movie, you're less likely to interrupt other people's experiences. As a regular attendee of the cinema, I've had many bad experiences for numerous reasons, which is what I'm gonna list out today. So, today, I will be educating my audience on not only etiquette while watching movies, but etiquette before and etiquette after. So, as a goer of a movie, you have to be respectful to other watchers. This means first and foremost, don't pull out your cell phone for any reason. Cell phones are a blinding light in a dark place. Imagine you're driving on the road, pitch black, and all of a sudden the sun's in the middle of the sky. It's crazy, it hurts people's eyes, it interrupts their experience, it's just rude. Cell phones also make sounds. Loud sounds, buzzing, ringtones, and when this is all happening during an epic fight scene, it just ruins your entire experience and wastes your money. Also, don't talk with other people. These conversations, especially if about the movie, can be harmful to other viewers' experiences and often lead in just distaste. Lastly, don't get up constantly. When you get up constantly, this causes other people's vision and attention to not remain on the movie. It makes people aware that they're not in this movie world, they go to the movie to be in, and it distracts their entire mind. So now that you know not how to disturb others during a movie, let me tell you about how to deal with those disturbing you. So, how do you deal with disrespectful watchers? Well, first of all, remain calm. You have probably done something annoying during a movie before. And just know that everyone makes mistakes and you should not get too mad about them or post about them on social media. It's just another normal person making an accident. So, what you want to do is remain calm, try your best to not make more of a uh, disruption, and go over to them, tap them on the shoulder, and whisper to them what they're doing and what they can do better. So now that we know how to not distract people, while, how, how to take people out that are distracting during a movie, uh, I want to tell you how to be respectful before and after. So, never, ever arrive at a movie late. So, being punctual is very important because if you walk in talking during the middle of a movie, uh, you are a moving distraction, you're talking, it's ruining people's focus, it's just very, very rude, and it's a business courtesy to always be on time. Secondly, you should not leave messes in your movie seat. Uh, when you sit down, you have buttery popcorn all over your hands, it's just not pleasant, you know, that it ruins half the movie because you gotta go to the bathroom and wash your hands and it just clean up, it's terrible. Don't ruin someone else's experience because of your laziness. So, in conclusion, when you're in a movie theater, always turn off your cell phones, don't distract others, be respectful when uh, correcting others, and always be on time and neat. If everyone in the world were to follow this etiquette, never again would you be taken out of an amazing movie by a sticky seat, a cell phone, or a loud conversation.